Let's get to your first alert weather oh. with Jeff because, honestly, to put it plain, going to be cold, going to yeah. be windy. That's why we've got a weather alert, right? Yeah, it's going to be kind of a shock to the system. We've only had one day so far here in this month where the highs were in the 60s, about where they should be this time of year. That's happened once. All the other days we've had above normal temperatures for daytime highs put that in perspective we're currently the fifth warmest November on record so we're kind of do some cold air and we're going to get a shot of it that's actually coming in right now we will be around it's with this front we have weather alerts out because hey this is going to be jacket weather tomorrow because we'll have strong winds temperatures in the mid 40s uh, we won't really have any cloud cover with this front at all so expect sunshine through the afternoon the winds will come down a little bit by afternoon but still in the low 60s will make it for the coldest day we have had really since last spring. This is what we're looking at temperatures, some patchy frost tomorrow. Temperatures in the 30s and buoy uh, will be waking up in Graham with temperatures in the, in the upper 30s. So that's where the frost will be. And then 40s elsewhere. The official highs today, this is part of the shock of the system, right? We, we had a high today of 75, 10 degrees above normal this time of year. And we got temperatures uh, that started in the 50s this morning. So bus stop weather, we got temperatures starting in the 40s with the breeze. So make sure you got those kids in jackets and coats and Temperatures will warm up into the 60s and it'll be a very pleasant afternoon. About these winds behind this front, it's going to be a little breezy as we cross the overnight hours. You might hear it. And then tomorrow morning, the winds will still be up out of the north, gusting up to 20, 25 miles an hour at times. The winds will come down eventually as we get towards the morning, but it's going to make for those feel like temperatures. Now, these are not the temperatures. These are the feel like temperatures. When you add on the wind and you see a lot of 30s across the board, that's how it will feel to you. In fact, you'll even feel below freezing or right at and up and across our northwest, like across Gainesville. So here's our first shot of November weather. Here's our next shot of November weather. And there's some great weekend weather ahead in Monday, upper 70s. But we cool down because we got rain chances as we get into Thanksgiving. That's the way it's looking right now, at least, that a front comes down and stalls. So we could have kind of a prolonged rain event where it's cloudy and we got drizzle, wouldn't be any big rain, wouldn't be thunderstorms. It would just be kind of dreary weather. We'll see as we get closer what pans out, but we'll give you a heads up now. Temperatures this weekend are going to be popping up into the upper 70s by Sunday, and they'll be like that on Monday. Great weather. Get out and enjoy this weekend. We'll be right back.